I was born and I grew up in an Arab Muslim culture in Tunisia and Northern Africa. One of the nicest memories about my childhood is also one of the saddest. It's about the female world. Very often, women would gather together away from the male gaze and they would dance. They would practice the oldest feminine ritual in the world, stepping back to Mesopotamia 4,000 years ago when the society was matriarchal and women were ruling and they would dance. And I remember as a little girl, I used to see these women dancing and I was like, wow, they looked so wild and so sensual and so beautiful and so alive. And I was like, I want to be like that. But at the same time, these same glorious goddesses, the moment they stepped out of the house to enter the outside world dominated by man, they turned into submissive slaves. They would literally and symbolically cover their femininity with a veil because their femininity in the outside male world is seen as a disturbance, as even a threat because it brings chaos. <laughs> I remember as a little girl, I was so pissed off. I used to ask my mother, why do we have to cover ourselves? What's wrong with being a woman? Why do we have to adapt to them and not the other way around? The only answer I got, because you are a girl. And I was like, yeah. So by the age of 13, I was so fed up that I wrote in my diary in French, je quitterai la Tunisie pour rester moi-même. I will leave Tunisia to stay true to myself. Because that was my girl's dream. I wanted to leave Tunisia and I wanted to study at the Sorbonne in Paris. And also, I wanted to go to the West because I wanted to be free. I wanted to be able to be as free as a bird, to fly and to unfold my wings, and the sky would be the limit. I wouldn't be chained by any masculine chains. So I left for the West. It was a very, very um, tough journey because in my culture, women, girls just don't live like that. But that was very dramatic, but let's not talk about that at the moment. So I left and I managed, and I succeeded into studying and having a PhD in the subject I was passionate about, gender studies. And here started my disillusion, a series of disillusions about women emancipation in the West. First of all, I noticed in the West that many, many women are not flying at all. The other part was struggling to fly, but they did, didn't get that high from the ground. And there was a very tiny little minority who could make it to the higher altitudes. And these ones looked a little bit strange to me because they looked like women, but they were flying like men. <laughs> and I was like, oh my God. Where do I have to go to be able to fly as a, like a woman, as high as I wish, to uh, planet Mars or planet Venus? Where? A series of disillusion went on with the gender studies because the gender studies are mostly dominated by feminism. And I think Western feminism achieved marvelous things for women. But there are certain concepts which were for me shocking for my system. First of all, the claim that the misery of women is men's responsibility. I simply refuse this argument. First of all, because it puts women as victim. And second, because as a child, I witnessed so often in Tunisia how women are actively supporting the patriarchal system by suppressing the daughters and the girl and by empowering the boys and the son. Women are also responsible for the system. The other part also, which for me was very strange in Western feminism, was the idea that femininity is a social cultural construction. I was like, oh my God, what's that? <laughs> so it's not a natural state of being. A social cultural construction. But I thought like, but this is not how I experienced that in Tunisia. Because in every cell of my body during this goddess dance, 
you could really feel feminine. You could feel women around you from the age of two years old until the age of 80, extremely feminine. This intellectual, cerebral conception of femininity was in shock with my whole system. But I thought, who am I coming from an Arab Muslim culture to tell to Western feminists that this concept is not okay? So <laughs> I just adapted and I followed the rules and I started doing like they did, which basically using my brain at work, adapting masculine qualities at work to enhance my career. And then when I would go home, then I would let free my feminine qualities. But of course, at a certain point, it didn't work anymore because I felt like I'm, I was living like a double life, like schizophrenic life. I am like behaving like a man at my work, behaving like a woman at, at my home. And that was completely exhausting because I couldn't just be myself. Until one day, I literally collapsed and I had a burnout. And that was a moment for me where I started looking around because I, I thought I was the only one. And then I looked around and I started talking about it and I found out many women were in the same situation. It's just that nobody talks about it. I honestly thought about, I'm gonna give up. But the words of my grandmother kept coming back to me. She was always to say, giving up is a luxury that we women cannot permit ourselves. We must, it's our duty to fight to change the system from inside. Fight or die with dignity. So I decided to go back to the battle, but this time I changed my strategy. This time I decided to fight like David fought the giant Goliath. I decided to use my own authentic way, which is femininity, because femininity, and this is what I want to share also with women, femininity is our sling. <laughs> I truly believe in balance between men and women, don't get me wrong, and between masculine and feminine. Not only between men and women, but in each individual. The only thing is we need more feminine qualities and values in society, in institutions, in politics, in finances especially, at the top of organizations. To my biggest surprise and also sadness, I saw more at the top of organizations, I saw more men using feminine qualities than women using feminine qualities. <laughs> the world is not in need for more masculine women. The, need is, the world is not a need for more brain power. The world is a need for more feminine qualities, for more womb power. Because in our womb, this is the seed for our feminine capital. And we can and we must engage it now for the human evolution. The question is, will women dare use their feminine print into the working environment? But now, enough brain talk, I would like to have some body talk. So I would like you, please, we don't have a lot of time, so I would like you to just do as I say. So please, I would like you all to stand up. Yes, Alors, focus, all stand up. I have, I want from you an open mind, no judgments, and just get out of your comfort zone. I have a very simple movement for men. Men have a simple yet crucial task, which is to hold the energy for women, to support. We can do the work by ourselves, but it's much nicer if you are with us, of course. So the men, you will do a very simple movement, and the women, they will do different movements. So the men, you will start, and women together, we're gonna start with the knees, you're gonna go up and down, and shake yourself. Yes, and women, you have to shake. I call this the higher intelligence. <laughs> so please, women, shake the higher intelligence. The man, I would like you simply to do like this, to open the heart, open the heart, and just give your heart to the women to do the work. Women, keep on shaking. Can we have music, please? Women, shake, shake, shake. Intelligence shaking, and shoulders, the women. The men just do like a shake. Come on. Gentlemen, you have to support us. What is this? Hello? Ladies, more. Ladies, I don't see the intelligence shaking. Yes, more. Yes. And breathe. Breathe. 
more, 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 shake the whole system. And then ladies, only the ladies, right, right. The men keep supporting. Ladies, rise, shake your intelligence more, 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 more. Breathe, breathe, breathe and rise. The hands, hands, very feminine fingers, yes. The sky is the limit, you remember? You fly like a lady. And down. Shoulders. Grow. Keep on shaking. Yes, more, 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 more. Shake, 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 shake. And now, arms. Don't hit the neighbor. Arms. Allez, ladies. More, more, more. Shake. More, more, more. And now. Shoulders. Very gently. Gentlemen as well. This is in the Arab world also a male movement. Macho like both. That we do it the feminine way. Ladies, gentle. The knees again. Voila, you see? Next. Sensual. Gentlemen, very gently. The he, the man, the same thing. The man, it's very simple. You have a simple life. Just do like this. Yeah? The women. Expand. Women. Men, don't get distracted. Uh, women, allez, ladies, your hips, your womb. Uh -huh. The rack. Circles, circles, very gently circles. Just make circles with your hips. Yes, it's not like hula hoop, you know, but slow. This is about expanding. You expand with your hips. Women are so afraid uh, to show their sensuality because they don't, we, they don't want to be seen as a lust object. You are not. You're just expanding with your hips. <laughs> The men just admire the view, that's all. You can admire with your eyes only, the rest stays inside. Ladies, don't get scared, don't cover, don't veil. Expand, hips, 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 more. Allez, more, yes, voila, très bien. More, yes. And now I'm gonna say something which is very, very sensitive, but it is what it is. We do this dance with the pelvic floor muscles with the vagina muscles. Usually, I never do this when men are around, but anyway. So ladies, forget that the men here are here. We open the gate and we close the gate on commando. You open, you close. You open, you close. You open, you close. This is to be in touch with the energy of your womb. Because by opening and closing the muscles, you feel the life force in your pelvis. And if this kind of movement sometimes don't work, then you have to be a little bit more clear, which means you have to be a little bit more aggressive. Here we go, everybody shake. Arms. Men, lift arms as well. The man, the man, you're gonna hold it like this. For the women, you're gonna carry them because they need to fight. Attention, ladies. Now you close your vagina. The gates are closed. <laughs> gates are closed. Higher the music, please. Ta. Allez, ladies, kick, kick, power, bang. Ta, ta, hop, hop. You have to push. Push, push, don't push with your elbows to make a career, yeah? No, push with your hips like a lady, come on, hoppa! Ta, 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 more, more, arms, and ladies, down! Up, the women, down, up, down, up, and down, and right, 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 whoopa! Here 
we go. More, 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 more. Be aggressive like a lady. You fight like a lady. Push, 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 push. Yes, and breathe. The gates are still closed. Attention. And shake. Here, mark. Breasts and pelvis. 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 The womb, the heart. The womb, the heart. Not only the brain. The womb and the heart. We know you all have brains, but the rest now is, is, is about time we have, we show the rest as well. Use the rest. The womb and the heart. The womb and the heart. The womb and the heart. Shake, 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 shake. And roll, shoulders, roll, roll. Proud, self-confident. You cannot be self-confident like this. I am so self-confident, you know? Don't you see how self-confident? I am self-confident. Whoopa! Yes. Shoulders here. And now, with your self-confidence, you will say no. No. Here. No. 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 The gates are still closed, huh? Up. No. 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 I don't agree. I don't. Why in West emancipated West Europe, why are women doing the same job as men and they are paid 18 to 30% less? Why? Because they have breasts and vagina? Why? When will you ladies stand up and say, no, no, I don't accept. There are not only women in the Muslim country which are suppressed, also in Europe. Shake, shake, no, no, up. shake, 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 no, no, no. I don't take this anymore, I refuse. I don't like the way the financial system is working in the world. I don't like the corruption at the top. I don't like the bonuses that people are touching and that people are dying from hunger. I don't like injustice. I don't like women to be suppressed. I don't like mothers to go back to work when they are still breastfeeding after three months and leaving their babies behind. I don't like this. I don't like this. And I say no, no, no. Say with me, no, 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 no. The man, you hold the ground. Whoppa, whoppa. Shake, 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 and rise. Play now. We're gonna play because, of course, we play. We fight hard and we play hard. Women, give me this. Hello, ladies. Yes, it's fine. No. And gentlemen, enjoy the ride. But keep on supporting, huh? Yes. Keep on supporting. <laughs> keep on supporting, gentlemen. And the ladies, Mark. 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 And the ladies, I want you to play here, proud to be a woman. You do this movement here, the sling, you remember? This one, here we go. Ale, I am proud to be a woman, and my femininity is my sling. It's like Statue of the Liberty in New York, you know? Now every time you will see the Statue of Liberty in New York, you will think about this. Yes, proud to be a woman. I am a woman and my femininity has a lot to offer to the world. I have so much to offer and I want to show you what I can offer you. I have a lot of qualities, feminine ones. The qualities of the Roomba. Hoppa, and change the other side. Hoppa, and the sling, the sling, sling. Femininity is your sling. Femininity is your sling, and the man hold the space. Hoppa! Shake and shake. Shake and shake, and again. Now all together. 
Yes, right. And then what I would like to do now, I would like you to take the hand of the person to your right and then to your left. Take the hand, don't be afraid. Right. Shake, 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 shake. United we dance, united we lead. 